Hello, I'm Dr. Carrie Finley, and I, along with colleagues Jay Otto and Dr. Nick Ward, are excited about a recently published article called The Role of Social Capital in Traffic Safety Citizenship. We know that safety on our nation's roadways is an important goal. We also know from research that 94% of serious crashes are linked to human behaviors. To reach zero deaths on our nation's roadways, we must look at ways to change human behaviors. This study explored intervening with strangers, engaging in potentially risky behaviors like not wearing a seatbelt and texting while driving. The study examined one aspect of social capital, perceived trust among individuals. Our sample include 1,260 adults across the United States. Traffic safety citizenship is an approach to traffic safety that focuses on leveraging the strong, positive road safety culture that already exists in communities to impact the small group of risky road users most resistant to change. Social capital has been defined as resources that are available through the relationships we have with others and through those networks that are created through the relationships we have. Through one's connections to others, resources that may otherwise be unavailable are accessible and can be used. In this journal article, we made recommendations based on the results and findings of our study. Efforts to grow bystander engagement do not need to focus as much on why people should intervene or that people should intervene. Instead, efforts should seek to build people's comfort and confidence in intervening by showing them how to do it. Furthermore, values could be used to frame communications to bolster a sense of trust. Traffic safety has been and remains a significant public health issue. Traffic safety citizenship offers a novel approach to address this issue. Intervening with strangers engaging in potentially risky behaviors, like not wearing a seatbelt, is an example of safety citizenship behavior. Social capital is an indication of the strength of social relationships in a community, and social capital may influence adoption of safety citizenship. While it is clear that traffic safety professionals and stakeholders have significantly improved traffic safety in the United States, our nation's goal of zero deaths and serious injuries on our roads has not been fully realized and new approaches may be required. Traffic safety citizenship is a new opportunity to improve traffic safety. It's an approach that leverages our existing positive traffic safety culture and once established is likely to be sustained. This published article is an open access article that can be found online or by going to our website, chsculture.org.